the Michigan Masonic Home is having their first annual sports tournament, and I have questions. First of all, how are they going to find ice this time of year, and what kind of puck are they going to use that's going to be able to... Softball. I don't know anything about... Now we're going to visit the headquarters of the Titanium, Titanium Warlords. Warlords. Oh, hello, dude. Oh, hi. Well, hi, Adam. How are you doing? Just uh, listen, listening to a few tunes, huh? Yes. How's it going today? I, I'm doing real well. How are you doing? Pretty well. Pretty well. Just preparing for our softball game. Yeah, yeah. Looks like you're ready. Looks like you're ready. You've got your beverage all ready, ready, set to go. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, let me just, let me get my questions out here. Who do you think is going to win this, uh, this uh, tournament? Dale, you know, the other teams have already really won since we actually agreed to come out and play them in the tournament. We had to cancel our pretty much the rest of our schedule, put like the, the Tigers and the White Sox on hold. So, um, but we're trying to give back to the community here. So that's, that's kind of the point to have fun and, and give a good community spirit. So. Well, that's nice. I appreciate your, uh, your spirit of generosity. Mm -hmm. Well, that's really funny. There's uh, really no question. The name says it all. We're the ball busters and uh, we're here to win. Okay. Well, that, that settles that. Yeah. Danielle's Dominators for sure. That's a definite yes, huh? Definite That's definitely yes. you guys. All right. Well, I guess now we know that for sure. Well, I believe that the bench warmers are going to win the tournament um, coming up. Absolutely. Hands down. Okay. Well, good. We, we got that settled, huh? What makes you uh, better than all the, other, all the other teams? Well, we don't like to brag, but... Uh, some teams, they need to go over the top with their smack talk. We like to keep it clean. That's nice. That's nice. Mm -hmm. I appreciate that. Why you think that you're the better team? Oh, there's just not enough time to talk about in this, in this interview, Dale. That would, that would take probably a good year. I, you better move on to the next question. Uh, oh. You know there's a lot of tough talent out there, so the skill set's going to be tough, but I think they're underestimating us, so we're going to bring our A game. I feel like the bench warmers have great teamwork, and I think that uh, we are going to high five and smile our way to victory in every single game. What is your team like? I mean, uh, do you have your members of your team now? I do, yes. Um, a lot of strong personalities, a lot of determination, um, a lot of people, individuals from the kitchen, so they're not. Um, they're not afraid of the heat, so we'll bring that. That's good. That's good to know. We have a couple of uh, individuals who uh, who have some skill sets. We have the uh, Joe Shooter Shattuck. You know, he's he's going to give us a little boost for our team. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got uh, Tanya. I'm going to take you out, Dietrich. She's she is definitely uh, going to surprise some people. So uh, so we have some skill set there too. Well, right now they're pretty bored. This is going to be a this is going to help us stretch our legs, you know, and stay into shape a little bit. But like I said, we're looking to forward to getting this done, you know, giving back to, to some of these um, amateur starting out groups so then we can get back to our regular schedule. I see. I so. see. I see. Very. Well, um, we have only promoted the elite uh, team members, so we've done extensive trainings, um, sessions. 5 a.m. sand runs, followed by uh, BP in the cage, you know, suicides. Uh, uh -huh, uh -huh. We've been practicing with a national team, travel team, <laughs> and uh, I don't want to give away any names, but it's definitely uh, fine-tuned our team. How are you going to pull this off? What's your strategy for this? Our strategy is just to smile and overwhelm people with our teamwork. That's it. That's our total strategy. Okay. We're uh, going to play it down for uh, our opponent's level. We're gonna get down to our opponent's level and uh, you know, keep them interested. We're mm -hmm. gonna just slow things down for them. Okay. You know, the strategy is to play ball. Um, have fun and um, certainly 
um, do the best we can to um, to kind of serve that purpose. Okay. We, our team likes to always have a strategy to have a strategy. <laughs> if we were to take a look at your opponents, what do you think are the weak points of your opponents? Well, you have Daniel's dociles, and I, I think, you know, we're definitely going to, uh, I, I, I think we're going to uh, have a great friendly game, but I definitely see us edging them out, and um, I would say that uh, Jamie's, uh, Jamie's Ball Busters team is, is going to uh, probably be a little um, over the top in terms of uh, where they think they're at in skill set, and I, and I think that um, I think we're going to get the best of, of both of them, and then Adam. You know, obviously the uh, the metalheads uh, that they have going on. I think I think that uh, their skill is uh, is going to be high, but I think that they might just implode once they once they see the team work on our side. I mean, what aren't the weak points with our opponents? Um, have you seen those guys? Uh, well, you know, actually, I've only the, seen the coaches, but uh, yeah, yeah, that uh, that the bench warmers guy that that Sean throws like a girl. I. <laughs> I don't know what to say about them. And then there's the, uh, I'm not sure, sure about the, uh, the Danielle team, but, but the Jamie, the ball, the, the, the balling breakers or whatever, the crybaby, I don't know what it's called, but those guys, she'll probably be too busy putting on her, like her second coat of mascara in the, in, you know, second or third inning. So probably mm -hmm. not much to worry about there, dude. Well, uh, you know, hitting, catching, fielding, you know, the basics. Okay. I think they might be a little more focused on fun. We're, we're pretty focused on winning. So less is more for us. Um, certainly we'll be there to have fun, but we want to win. There you go. About that trophy. Mm -hmm. uh, is this is this what, that's what this is here? This? Uh, yeah, these are, uh, we've been in numerous tournaments on uh -huh. the team and we've won. Oh, I see, yeah. You can yeah. see our trophy collection here. Uh, it, that's... We're 100 and zero, uh, but I do have one. Uh, one spot right here for this trophy. Okay, so. fortunately you've got one corner left yes. on your table yep. for that yep. there. Okay. Got one corner. We will display the trophy wherever the team decides it is best represented for for the facility. So I don't know where that's at yet. We'll have to think about okay. that. Okay, we'll kind of, kind of put that to a vote, huh? Yes. Okay. We're going to ask the residents. Uh, we want them to have, to be able to see it and enjoy it as much as we do. Um, but ultimately, um, right in that prime spot in the kitchen, um, so we can definitely uh, remember the the good times, the good games. Well, it's funny you should ask that. The um, the ball breakers, the ballers, they they um they stole the trophy earlier today. They did. Uh, yeah, they they stole it. Uh, one of the team members, Lindsey Young, took the trophy and uh, and hit it. So um, really, the sweet taste of victory is going to be enough for us. We don't actually need a trophy. They'll have, they'll have to deal with their their shame after after the beating on the field. So, <laughs> well, maybe they'll they'll bring the trophy to the game. Do you think? I don't think so. I don't mm. think so. I think they're gonna just keep it to themselves. That's kind of the that's kind of their um, philosophy. That's how they operate. Thank you, Danielle. I appreciate it. Thank you. Is there anything else that you would like to add? No. I, we're all looking forward to some friendly competition and uh, taking home the trophy. Great. Thank you. Thank you. Anything else that you would like to add? Um, I just want to tell the opposing teams, you know, if you're not first, you're last. <laughs> All right. Um, do you have anything else that you would like to add? Um, no, we're just trying to give back to the community and, and, you know, teach some people how to play some softball and, and be good sports. So that's, uh, that's what we're after. Okay. All right. Well, great. Well, thank you. Uh, thank you very much, Sean. I do appreciate it. If wait, I could wait, wait. Sean is the... Is oh, the yeah. Sean. Oh, Sean's the other yes, guy. Yes, yes. We're, we're the Titanium Warlords. Titanium Warlords. Yes. yes. All right. Well, thank you. Uh, thank you, Adam. We sure do appreciate it and uh, wish you all the best. Okay. Thank you. Take care. All right. So, who's going to win this hockey softball tournament well that's obvious it's the one with the most athleticism that plays the best ball you know
know who you are. Good job.